Hi again, it's Jolly John here. And I'm not really going to be covering a lot of news today. I just want to cover one story basically that's it's in the mainstream. And, you know, unless you've been hiding under a rock with your fingers in your ears, I'm sure you've heard about it. It's the earthquakes in Turkey. And I'm doing, doing this video because I think there's something that a lot of people have been overlooking. I mean, I've seen articles and I've heard people talk about, well, is it, you know, is it harp? Is it America attacking Turkey with harp? Because they've been sending in troops here, there and everywhere. And, you know, other wild theories. And, yeah, I can understand where these things come from. You've only got to look at the map and see the clustering where these earthquakes are happening. I mean, you know, it's in such a small area it's just mind-boggling and at my last count there was 122 earthquakes in the last 16 hours and you know by any stretch of the imagination that is a huge significance of something that is going on but you know like I say there's something that everybody's been overlooking and I went looking around to, to find answers. And I came across a startling, you know, revelation to me anyway. People probably out there already know this, but I didn't. Uh, Turkey has a lot of volcanic activity. And it just so happens where all these earthquakes are, are epicentering is next to a lake called Lake Van and what runs along the edge of Lake Van on the opposite side is a volcanic ridge of mountains that contains the two of the largest mountains in Turkey so you know that they're classed as extinct volcanoes but you know it, the evidence is there it's, it's a volcanic ridge there that runs along the west side and there's a little outcrop that runs back down the east side as well. And it's like a V around it. Uh, you know, that could be a coincidence. It just struck me as just very odd that all of these quakes are in that small area that just happens to be the same place that there's a volcanic range. And it is, it's a huge line of mountains that run along that edge. Go and check it for yourself. I'll put the links down there at the bottom to, you know, the earthquake uh, mapping software online and, you know, anything else that I, I think is relevant. Uh, but there you go. That's, that's what I've come across. I think it's another sleeping giant waiting to wake up. Which in itself is, is a devastating thing. It's... You know, why are all these volcanoes waking up now? It's it's another riddle that has got to be sorted out. But as for the earthquakes being, you know, an attack of some sort, uh, you know, I'm not going to rule it out. It could be, could well not be. There's just another uh, piece of the puzzle to put in the mix and for you know, to sort out. So, as always, make up your own mind. Until next time, it's a raw. This is crazy, this is crazy, this is crazy.